Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I am PMIBG 1.0, but in short you can call me Bob. As an MC of this event, it is my very great privilege to welcome you all to PMI Bulgaria Annual Conference at this very extraordinary and special day. I hope you have started well and enjoyed this day so far. I must say I feel extremely thankful for your visit today, which not only marks your interest in the topic related to project management, but also pays tribute to all people involved in designing, planning, speaking and participating in project management development for many decades to come. Now, without further ado, I would like to present you and invite on the stage, for his welcoming address, our extremely enlightened and dedicated to project management servant leader the Chairman of Board of Directors and President of PMI Bulgaria Chapter, Mr. Mihail Mihaila. Wow, uh, even I'm surprised of this. I see this for the first time. The intro, did you like it? Really, really amazing. Okay. Um, good morning, everyone. Dobro utro. Kak ste? First of all, I would like to thank you all. And why? Why I'm thanking you? It's because of this. This is the participation of this conference through the years. And this year we hit another record, 630 registered for the conference. You can see the trend. And thank you very much for trusting us, to keep trusting in PMI Bulgaria chapter. We do this for you, and I hope you like it. Um, this actually, if you look at the statistics of uh, PMI European chapters, brings us to the top of the attendance rates in Europe. Only a couple of other chapters in the whole Europe achieve such kind of numbers. And most of them are for two days event, not one day. So I'm really proud uh, to have you here and welcome. How, we do, how do we achieve this? First of all is passion passion for project and uh, passion for volunteering. I always use the opportunity to share with you uh, that this event is made possible by volunteering effort, purely. None of the, of the members of this project team receives a paycheck for this. So let's applaud them. Yeah. Also, passion for collaboration and win-win. Continuous improvement. I'm sure you see the improvement with every year. That's why the numbers are increasing, and that's why you're here. Also, the passion for making impact in the professional community and the society. As you know, the chapter has a lot of social projects lately. So we really want to make this impact. We really want to give back to the profession and the passion to make things happen, to see the final result. You know, this is one of the values of, uh, and one of the great drivers and motivators of the project managers, to see the result, to see the success. So, let's have a little bit of pyramid talk. What do I mean? This is the first uh, project followed PM Bok. <laughs> yeah, actually, this is a long time ago, and people didn't know about project management that time. Not in this structured way that we know it today, yeah? But they made it happen. So we actually learned from them, not that they learned from us. But anyway, so this is something that remains uh, even today, so many years after. This pyramid, you know it very well, yeah? I hope. 
this shows what actually drives us people, what motivates us. Yeah? And you can go on the next level only when you have the previous level satisfied. Yeah? But the one that I want to show you is actually this one, when speaking about intelligence, how intelligence is built over time. So this is famous with the D-I-K-Y pyramid, or knowledge pyramid, or wisdom hierarchy. But this is, this is how it's built. We start with the layer of data, and every step up the pyramid answers questions and add value to the previous one. Then we have structured information that helps us take decisions. Then also we have uh, knowledge that is accumulated, accumulated information over time, and then we have the wisdom. So, yeah, these are the building blocks. First, the collection of the data that gives us the facts, the raw data that we analyze and get to the point of information where we make better decisions. Then, the knowledge or how we connect the pieces. How we connect the pieces and how we know how to use them. And then comes the wisdom that actually answers the question why we need to do something like this. What's the best way to do it? What's the best approach? Yeah. So, I want to make a little bit of uh, digestion of this pyramid, a little bit to, to add a technological layer. You know, our conference motto is project management intelligence. I hope you notice already. And we will speak today about business intelligence, technological intelligence, and emotional intelligence. So, let's bring a little bit the technological layer to this. So, how the data is managed and, uh, and collected is through databases, right? Then, when we get to the information, so to the information, we have the business intelligence. You've, you, uh, I hope a lot of you have used a lot of business intelligence tools. It's not only reports, but also how we extract the data from the different systems, how we use it to take business decisions and uh, achieve the strategic goals of a, of a company. Then we, when we talk about knowledge, we have a lot of systems like content management system, learning management systems, document management systems. But all, we, all of us, we are striving to the top level, wisdom. How the wisdom come? Who is managing the wisdom? People, right? You like this one? <laughs> He's a very, very famous person in the entertainment business. But maybe you like this one as well. Yeah. And more and more, we talk about artificial intelligence on this level, yeah. Artificial intelligence, robots that are coming, and it's a hot topic lately, how the artificial intelligence will impact our world, how it will impact our works, positions. Are we threatened or are we helped? So, and what actually uh, separates us, what, what actually is... Uh, the uh, difference between artificial intelligence and people? Emotions. Emotional intelligence. This is the, the, what makes the difference. So today, we will try to cover the, all aspects of this pyramid and talk about all the different aspects, like artificial intelligence, business intelligence, technological intelligence, and I'm sure you will love it. So, put your happy faces and enjoy. Thank you.